Okay, so the uh, the next fly out of the uh, the series of the Rook and River Trouting um, is the classic partridge and orange. So some uh, orange Pearsall 6A silk, um, a small piece of fine gold wire, and I'm going to use one of these muffle feathers off the back of a partridge. There. Size 14, um, straight eye spider hook. Yeah. Straight eye, wide gate, it's got a barb, it's just going to match the barb down. Using Pearsall's 6A silk, this is the uh, quite a bright orange coloured silk. I'm going to knock that off. turns just to get that started. <coughs> Edmonds and Lee says that we can actually rib this fly with some gold wire, so I've got some fine gold wire to go in here. Body length as long as you want it. I'm going to take this down to about halfway between the um, point of the hook and the bar. Touching turns coming back up again. Rib. They say about four turns. Rip that off. And then for the hackle, it is uh, the mottled uh, partridge feather from the back of the bird. Just going to prepare it in the normal way, create that little V. So a little tying in V in there. Want the natural curve of the feather along the back of the hook itself. Tighten at that V point. Snip off the tip pat. And then get my hacker pliers up. Dump my fingers. Bit of a chevron back these fibres. Roll them back into chevron. And then number of turns, number of legs, down to the individual. I think about one and a half on this one. Pull the Fiber, uh, pull the stackle hook, um, hackle stalk forwards 90 degrees to my tying silk so I can tie that down. Three turns in there should be sufficient just to lock that down whilst I just sneak in with my scissors. The two extra fibers there. I'll just hold everything back whilst I just finish off the head. <coughs> Simple whip finish. And that's one of the classic spider patterns, partridge and orange.